get a last little update video in for the end of the year. Uh, some of our customers have been waiting uh, patiently and uh, maybe we can uh, give them some kind of encouragement, let them know their motors are gonna be shipped out next week or ready for pickup either or. So basically for the last three, four weeks, I've been a one-man band as far as the engine building goes. Jerry hurt his back earlier and has been taking some time off, so I hope he's at home getting some rest and uh, can come back strong. So anyway, did a little regroup, put in a little extra hours, no big deal. It's not like I've never done it before. We're catching up real quick. This one's Todd Silicados 2332. It's going to Hawaii. Um, I've already done the break-in for it. Um, the break-in on a new motor, and all that's good. And sink the carburetor, dialed it in. Man, this thing sounds awesome. It's nice and smooth. We put it on the low, ran it. I mean, this thing's awesome. This is our uh, 175 horsepower motor. Uh, 175 torque, usually square. It's running the one and five eighths stainless A1 exhaust system. Since it's going into a Baja, it's got the like, looks like the tri mill style exhaust system. Of course, this is a thick wall stainless tubing for A1 made here in the USA. I think he calls that his bullet pump. Running the 44 IDF Weber's. It has CNC 4237 ported heads, forged crank, rods, just like all our motors. This thing's solid. So this thing's all dialed in. It's also got one of the MP. Uh, new MP billet distributors in it. Black, black distributor, black cap, black sheet metal, black pulley. This thing looks sharp. Um, can't wait till he gets it. Todd, thank you for your patience. Really appreciate that. This thing will be ready to pick up next week. I'll get it boxed up Monday or Tuesday for you, and you can send your shipper. I'll give you a call Monday or Tuesday to confirm. Um, but this one's all dialed in and ready to go. So, like I said, we're getting caught up. Things are working out good. We got John Bestwick's done. His motor's finished up. I'm not sure if he's coming to pick it up. We may box it up maybe next week and ship it out. Richard Bowman's 1914, it's ready to go. We put videos both on both those motors last week on our YouTube page, Powerhouse VW. If you're not following us, check it out. Hit the subscribe button, turn on notification for updates. Um, Richard Bowman, that reminds me, he showed up Friday to pick it up uh, and I feel bad because he drove out here and he just missed us, I had stepped out. So if you're gonna come from a long distance or something, maybe just give us a ring first just to make sure. I hate for you guys to drive all the way out. Either way, he rescheduled, and I'll see you next week. I think you said Tuesday, so um, that's done. But yeah, we're making progress. Everything's working out good. Another customer that's been waiting patiently. This one is for Tony Frazier. This is our 2387, 200 horsepower combo. This one's gonna go to Oregon and go into a 65 VW panel bus. We have it set up for heater boxes and uh, heater hoses. He doesn't have the boxes yet. I think he's gonna put those on at some point when he gets the car right now we just have flange we have the flange a1 sidewinder system with a single straight back tailpipe outlet 48 idfs the port shroud this one's running the magnet spark cnc ported uh, heads from um mp cnc ported heads l these are l7s so this one's just about ready uh tony all you do is finish up the carburetors spark plug wires a couple more details here and this one will be fired up and um, I will call you on Monday or Tuesday and let you know, go ahead and send your shipping die and uh, get this one picked up. So this one's done. And then of course we have the Pro Charger that I've been threatening for the last, who knows, <laughs> long time now. And right when I think I'm about to finish this one up, something happens, we get stalled out a little bit, but this one is very, very close. Um, I had to get caught up on these four or five motors, six motors that have been kind of all done for the last month just needed to be fired up. Without Jerry here, I'm kind of had to just shift gears and do a couple other things. We got Malia's 1914. This one should have been done as well. This one is, it's a short block. All I have to do is put the heads and cylinders on it, finish putting the valves back in the heads. And uh, we've already had the powder coat. It's been pre-fit, powder coated, and the carburetor set up and everything. She's gonna supply her own exhaust. So we pretty much have everything there. Um, for those that I haven't mentioned, their motors are coming up too. So if we haven't heard about your motor yet, it, it's definitely in, in progress. We have we have shrouds at the powder coater, shrouds, uh, pour shrouds at our painter. We have parts at the polisher. As a matter of fact, I'll call Bernie on Monday. I think we're waiting on four more fan shrouds for motors. And um, we have stuff at the anodizer, or actually, excuse me, stuff going to the anodizer. Um, and I'll be calling Tiger, Tiger on Monday or Tuesday looking for some exhaust that we have on order. So a lot of things are good. MP's been coming through getting them some cylinder heads, some cranks, rods, cases. So everything's, some, some of the stuff's hard to get. So we're staying ahead of that and um, everything's working out. So thank you guys for watching. Thanks to the customers, all your patience. We really appreciate that. Everything's going well. Have a happy new year's. Be safe.